If you're looking to boost your Mutt team or make some money by selling coins, check out MobileMaddenCoins.com. Use code CLICKWID at checkout for a 10% discount. Right, are you guys ready? Let's do it. Clap your hands. The alphabet. Beg you, ABCs, they can help you move, so get up and dance with me. Hey, what is going on, guys? Clickwood here back again, bringing you guys another Draft Champions video here on Madden 16. And guys, today what we're going to be doing is something new. We're calling it the Alphabet Draft, okay? I've actually seen this on some other channels for FIFA. Thought it would be something we could try out for Madden, see what we think. I think it was kind of cool when they were doing it on FIFA. So basically, the idea is this. The very first round, we're actually going to be looking for a player whose last name starts with an A. If we find anybody that starts with an A, we're going to be drafting them. And then obviously, from there on, we're going to move to B. If there's no Bs, we'll move on to C. And every subsequent round will be continuing on all the way through Z. And then again, we'll start again at A. So it makes it kind of a little bit random. We don't really get to decide what positions we're picking or anything like that. So uh, with that being said, it's going to be the alphabet draft. Wish me some luck. Let's get into the draft, guys. We're starting things off in round one. This is season four, by the way, of draft champions, guys. And we're starting it off very quickly with some nice players, man. We're starting off with, uh, it looks like it's going to be a DeAndre Hopkins. That is a beautiful DeAndre Hopkins card. Team of the year. By the way, this is a guy who deserves an upgrade of this card. One of the best receivers in the league this past year. So uh, yeah, so A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H. H is the first letter of these three last names. So we're going to be going with him next, obviously, round. We're going to be starting with an I. So DeAndre Hopkins to start off. Not too bad. That's probably who I would have picked out of all of them anyway. So, got to go with an I now. Uh, J-K-L-M-N-O-P. It looks like we're going with Jason Peters. Unfortunately, wish we could go with Giovanni Bernard here, but uh, Jason Peters will be our player here. So, we're on P. Now, we got to go to Q. Q-R-S-T-U-V-W-X-Y-Z. Unfortunately, don't have any players, so we've got to start off again. A, B, C, D, E. It's going to be Zach Ertz, the tight end, and that is going to be our pick for this round. 83 overall, not terrible. He's an okay tight end, so it could be a lot worse. So we got E, F. It is an F, so there you go. Arian Foster. Beautiful. We actually got a decent running back here. I might... I might end up using uh, Andre Ellington a little bit, but um, I definitely like that we're going to be able to get an F here. Uh, Arian Foster is it's a decent pick here. I bet best of all the players that were there, even though he's a little bit slow. So we're looking for a G now. Uh, G H I J K L. So we're going Taylor Lewan. Damn it. All right. We're going to end up probably putting him at right tackle or maybe Jason Peters at right tackle. Um, but unfortunately, it would have been nice to get Alex Mack there. Uh, but that's all right. We got we got two decent outside uh, tackles, so uh, that could that could be worse too. So we got an L there. So last round we had an L. So now we got to go M. Nothing N O P. So we got to go all the way to W before we get to another letter that's in the alphabet. So it's going to be Terrence Williams here. Chances are we're probably not going to find anything in the last few rounds. So we're probably going to be starting back over at the beginning of the alphabet. We've got Terrence Williams here. So we've got two decent receivers. X, Y, Z, nothing. So we're starting over at the beginning of the alphabet again, and we're going to go Jordan Hicks here because it's A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H. So there you go. We've got Jordan Hicks, middle linebacker. Not bad, actually. Could be a lot worse. I, J, K, L, M. Derek Morgan is our next player. So 77 speed. This is a weak one. I wish I could have drafted Vernon Davis because I really, really like using him. Uh, David Amerson's actually pretty good too, but we do have to go with Derek Morgan based on the alphabet game. So moving on to the N now and nothing there going all the way. It looks like going to be all the way back at the beginning of the alphabet again. So it's going to be Mike Adams that we've got to go with here. And man, this is not a good card. <laughs> 82 speed. How many? We have like one elite round, it feels like, this entire damn thing. We got that first round that was really good, and ever since then, it's been crap. So, all right. Back to the Bs. Hopefully, we can start to get some good stuff here. B. All right. We got Michael Bennett, so at least we get ourselves a decent pass rusher. He's quite a bit slower than what I usually like to see out of a defensive end, but at least he's decent. So, let's move on now to C. Come on. Give me something good. No. T. 
damn it. All right, so it looks like the next letter that we're gonna be going up to is an M. And because it's M and then we've got two M's, we're gonna be going to M-A-N because that's gonna be quicker or earlier in the alphabet if you were to sort it. So we do have to go with Nick Mangold here as our starting center. Next one is gonna be an N. We've still got four rounds left. Man, this feels like a terrible draft. And finally we get something good. Um, but unfortunately, we can't draft Bud Dupree, who's one of my favorite players to use uh, because we're starting with an M, so, or actually with an N. So the next one that we have to draft is unfortunately, oh my gosh, we could have Brandon Cooks with 99 speed. Oh, the alphabet game's coming to screw us, man. We got to draft another freaking offensive lineman. Unbelievable. Brutal, dude. Brutal, brutal, brutal. So we're on to TU is our next one. V, W, X, Y, Z, nothing. So unfortunately, we start back at the beginning with A for Allen, and that is going to be Nate Allen, strong safety. Move on now to a B. Three more or two more rounds left. This, this draft seems like it's absolutely awful, to be completely honest with you. This might not be the move in the future. <laughs> and it looks like we're going to be on Dominic Easley for our pick here. So, um, I mean, at least we're shoring up our defensive line a little bit, getting some decent pass rushers in there, some run stuffers at least. Uh, and the final one after we got an E, so we got to go to an F, and it's going to be to Brickishaw Ferguson, our fourth offensive lineman or fifth offensive lineman. So at least we're going to have a beast offensive line, but unfortunately, not a whole lot of skill position players for this team. Debrickshaw Ferguson is the best overall of this bunch, but he's certainly not the player that I would select. I would definitely go Portis right now because we've got a we've got Arian Foster at running back who's not very good. Even Steve Atwater would be a great pick, but Debrickshaw Ferguson is the man. So there you have it. That is going to be our selection for this video. Hopefully we can generate a decent lineup here, but God, it looks awful at first. 82 overall is what we're looking at. All right, so we changed around our offensive line a little bit, uh, which actually brought us down to an 81 overall because I put Jason Peters here. Now, the reason that he ends up looking bad is because his awareness drops quite a bit when you take him out of position. So he becomes a 68 overall at right guard, but his attributes are actually pretty good with a 92 run block, good strength and things like that. So I'm not too worried about the awareness or anything like that. Um, the rest of our team though looks absolutely brutal. We only have an Andy Dalton. He's not great at throwing it deep and uh, DeAndre Hopkins is really our only great receiver. Terrence Williams is okay at best, but he's only an 80 overall. Defensively, we're not looking too great. We do have a decent middle linebacker here for me to use or control with Jordan Hicks, uh, but everybody else is pretty darn mediocre. We only have one elite on the entire defensive side of the football. Gosh, this is just such an awful draft. It basically gave us all offensive linemen, unfortunately. So uh, that is going to do it for the draft, guys. Let's get right into the gameplay and see if we can make something happen with this god-awful team. Move your body to the letters. You know it's true. It's the ABCs are moving you. All right, guys. Opening kickoff against Jay Goose 23. Oh, Devin Hester is just so trash at this point. Remember when he was actually good? Remember those days? All right, guys, first play on offense. Let's try and get things going here through the air. Get it, Ertz. Oh, what a grab. In coverage, making the play. Let's go. That was a dangerous throw, but Ertz has got it, man. All right, let's see if this guy's going to come out and run a bunch of two-man under defense. We'll see. Nope, not this time. We've still got our man, DeAndre Hopkins, for a nice first down snag. Let's go. All right, so he's definitely bringing out, like, quarters defense. So hopefully we can just smash the ball right up the middle on him. Yeah, look at that. Nice big hole opening up there. Guys making blocks down the field, but unfortunately we got tackled before we could get there. We're going to try running it here again here, man. On third and three, I feel like we can pick this up. Yeah, there we go. Big hole. Area Foster up the middle again. We've got a big bruising offensive line. We've got to take advantage of it. All right, so we've done two runs up the middle in back-to-back -back play. So now we're going to try and go throw it down the field here. Maybe even go deep. Got Ertz again, and he is open. Let's go, baby. That coverage isn't there. That coverage is not there for him. I love it. Got to try and continue to pound the rock here up the middle with Foster, especially if he's not going to stack the box. There we go. Nice runs there. I mean, we're only picking up six or seven, but that's definitely enough to make him concerned. All right, so this time he's definitely stacking the box more, but I still feel like we can run it right at him pretty much, to be honest with you. Uh, yeah, screw it. Let's just run it right at him again. Yeah, the, the run's still there, man. As long as he isn't bringing guys up, we're just pretty much able to run it right up the middle for four, five, six, seven to play. Doesn't look like he's gonna come out of his quarters D. 
but uh, we've, we've set him up here for the outside run. It looks like we've got the blocking and we get into the end zone. Nice little juke there by Arian Foster. Frustrating that my guy didn't go up and block him, but Foster makes the play anyway and we get into the end zone. Nice drive, mixing it up on offense, throwing the ball and running the ball. Good first drive, I like it. All right guys, first and 10 here. And got a throw coming. Nice pressure coming in and unfortunately makes the great throw on the run there. That is a little bit frustrating to be honest with you. Oh, nice run up the middle. Caught me off guard there. That was a little bit of a draw play, I think. Nice nice play call. Another run up the middle. Good play, man. I got to give it to him. He's making the right calls right now. All right, we're going to be sitting right in the middle here if he tries to run up the middle again. No, nope, he didn't this time. Come on. Let's go. Big sack, though. Let's go. Big pressure coming in. My opponent's definitely got to go deep here. Third and 19. He's got to go deep. Oh, never mind. He's going to throw it short and still pick it up. Damn it. We had just had nobody there. We just had nobody there. He fumbled, though. Let's go. Huge turn of events. Let's go, baby. Huge. Got to love it, man. I didn't have anybody underneath because I thought for sure he would try and throw it deep to the sticks, and it just worked out perfectly for me. Another toss, and we've got the edge again. Get it, Arian Foster. Oh, man, he nearly broke that one again. That would have been massive. All right, it's third and two. We're going to try and run it up the middle here, I think. Uh, yeah, that looks like it's probably the right move. And we've got the first down at least, so let's go, man. Keeping it consistent on the ground, making him think that we're going to run the ball. I'm still planning on passing quite a bit this game, though. All right, first and ten. And try and throw here. And he's going with the all-out run stop. And we do throw it this time. T. Willie getting loose. Oh, little spin move. Nearly breaks it for the touchdown. But we do pick up a huge gain there. Down at about the 12-yard line. Let's go, man. All right, here we go. Got to try and pass. Oh, he brought some heat on me that time. Got through. Damn it. So we took a sack there on first down. But I'm not overly concerned about it. Um, hopefully, we can still make something happen here. Let's do this. There we go. Come on. Oh, nearly got that one in there. It's all right. Third and 16. We're still okay. All right, guys. Third and 16. Got to try and throw here to pick this one up. Fake it. Nah, we're not going to find anybody. So we're going to go underneath here and just set up the easy field goal for us. Try and run out a little bit of clock here. Um, not a bad drive. We do only pick up three, though, so uh, not the end of the world, though. Could be worse. All right, come on, defense. Bring that heat. Get the tackle. Why? We better intercept that. Thank you. Oh, my goodness. I was about to rage. <laughs> Let's go, baby. We got the pick, though. In field goal position already. Well, pretty close to field goal position already. Only got to pick up a few yards. All right, guys. First and 10. Get it. There it is, Riley Cooper. Good grab, man. We're in field goal position again here. Just going to run some conservative offense here for the rest of this drive, I think. All right. <clears throat> Decent enough. Second and four now. We got our fullback in the flats. Picking up the first down. Getting out of bounds. Big play there. All right. Second and ten now. Going to cancel the play action here. Hopkins in the end zone for the TD. Let's go. So we do go into the half up 17 to nothing. Good first half for us. We forced that fumble. That was absolutely key. We got an interception. So we're definitely doing a great job on defense. Offensively, we're doing okay, but we could do better. All right, first and 10. Oh, nice play by my opponent there. We do make a nice tackle, though. Second and three. Oh, the screen pass is coming. Ah, we're not there for it. He breaks the tackle. Of course he does. Ah, damn it, man. I saw it coming, but I just didn't see it coming quite quickly enough. Can't let him get things going here on offense. Yeah, there we go. Good pressure. Oh, what a play by 24. 
Whoa, we sent Heat that time, and he went with the screen pass again, but we swatted it away. Big, big play there by our team. All right, guys, we've been bringing Heat pretty much every single play, so this time I'm actually going to drop him into coverage um, and uh, just make sure that hopefully we don't give up a deep one, and we don't. We get the nice play there defensively. Yeah, I dropped everybody because I had been bringing Heat, trying to get him a little bit thrown off of his game, and it looks like we're probably going to get the rage quit here. So... Very first alphabet draft. We walk away, I'm assuming, here with the W. Let's see if it comes. Yep, there it is. So we get the win here in the alphabet game. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed it. If you did, do me a favor. Drop a like on this video. Give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. And maybe next time we'll do a reverse alphabet or something. I don't know. Just something fun to do to mix things up a little bit. Thanks so much, guys. And I will talk to you guys again soon first half for us we forced that fumble that was absolutely key we got an interception so we're definitely doing a great job on defense offensively we're doing okay but we could do better all right first and 10 oh nice play by my opponent there we do make a nice tackle though second and three. Oh, the screen pass is coming ah we're not there for any breaks the tackle of course he does ah damn it man i saw it coming but i just didn't see it coming quite quickly enough can't let him get things going here on offense. Yeah, there we go. Good pressure. Oh, what a play by 24. Whoa. We sent heat that time, and he went with the screen pass again, but we swatted it away. Big, big play there by our team. All right, guys. We've been bringing heat pretty much every single play, so this time I'm actually going to drop him into coverage um, and uh, just make sure that hopefully we don't give up a deep one. And we don't. We get the nice play there defensively. Yeah, I dropped everybody because I had been bringing heat, trying to get him a little bit thrown off of his game. And it looks like we're probably going to get the rage quit here. So, very first alphabet draft. We walk away, I'm assuming, here with the W. Let's see if it comes. Yep, there it is. So we get the win here in the alphabet game. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, do me a favor. Drop a like on this video. Give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. And maybe next time we'll do a reverse alphabet or something. I don't know. Just something fun to do to mix things up a little bit. Thanks so much, guys. And I will talk to you guys again soon. <laughs> to all the and now we're through. Oh, ABC's a movie.